Good evening, everyone. My name is Heath Haskins, Code Primate, and this is Lumber Tycoon 2. Uh, tonight, we're going to be doing the second part of the um, one unit chop saw, and I've been playing around with it. I'm still sick, and it's going to continue to be sick, so it's going to be the sickest, awesomeness thing ever. <laughs> That's sick, bro. No. Um, one unit chop saw. We're going to continue on with the idea that I had um, with the units being or with the chop saws being staggered just a little bit. Uh, as you can see, I've continued on just a little bit up here, but I still need to test to see if this is actually going to work. So um, I brought up some gold wood from last time and I'm thinking about doing conveyors over the top. I don't know if a conveyor is going to work though. So I'm just gonna move this one out the way and see if I can't move it right on top here. Maybe, possibly. Okay, just like that. Mm, maybe, maybe that'll work. Hold on, I got a test. No, that's gonna push the wood up. All right, whoa, that's loud. Super loud, so loud. So, <laughs> all right, if we move this, let's see, right here, hold on, right there, and then we were to move everything off to the side, I wonder. Well, kinda. We would have to push the wood off to one side. <clears throat> so, it would probably, here, let's grab this off of here. Put it over here. I'm gonna use one of these to stop the wood from actually going anywhere. Do, do, do. Which direction are we heading? We're heading that direction, so let's turn. Place this right at the end, just as a little stopper. And then this would have to be all the way over to like the left-hand side. Oh gosh, that's going to be too long. Okay, um, hmm. Should I grab another one? Maybe. I'm not going to be able to put it back because those wires are there. Oh, well. That's why we're here. We're here to experiment and to try and to do things. So, turn, turn, turn. And let's just attach right here. Oh, for the person that was asking, uh, <clears throat> you were asking in the chat, like, it didn't line up. You couldn't get it to line up. Same thing happens to me and you just finagle it, just keep wiggling around. You'll find, you'll find the spot where it happens and now it's gone. Sweet, because that's what was meant to happen. <laughs> oh man, okay. So it's supposed to be right here. It didn't load right there, so we may have to reload. The lag, oh, I did try to play public. Um, in fact, I tried to get in like four times and I kept getting into the same server, so it was okay. And it just, every time I would load or every time I would start moving around, it would lag out. And it was just horrible, horrible lag tonight. So I don't know if that's, it's not my computer that's doing it. It's definitely something that's up with Roblox or something that's up with my internet service provider. So let's go ahead and reload here just real quick. And what I want to do is I want these four chop saws to definitely chop a piece of uh, one by one wood into four separate pieces. <clears throat> Hopefully that'll work. Because, oh gosh, wait, no, that's not going to work. This first one right here, this first blade, that's going to chop at the very end, which is going to miss. So technically this is, oh no, it's only going to give me three, technically. <laughs> so wherever it starts, it's going to be off by one. Oh no. Okay. If the lag keeps going the way it's going, I'm, I might just have to head over to the maze or something. Do something different this episode. Because this is crazy. Oh my gosh, so many gifts. Yay. Uh, okay. Working, working, working. By the way, this is a freshly loaded private server. 
And, uh, okay, to answer the questions. Yes, um, the private server is permanent when you buy one, but you have to pay for it each month. So it's, it's a monthly charge of however much it costs for a private server. <clears throat> if you want to order a private server, go on the um, Lumber Tycoon 2 page and you have about store leaderboards servers. You can click on servers and do a purchase or a create private server. That's a blue button, it's big. You, you won't miss it. But that's how you create a private server. And the server itself is, is just an instance of the game. So like, you know how there's four or five instances running at one time? It says like there's billions of players, but you, you only have six at a time. That's basically it. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna try and run to it. Oh gosh, Oh, I know there's not gonna be anything on the ladder, so I should be safe to climb the ladder. As long as I stay on the ladder, I don't have to worry about stuff resin in and blowing up on me. <clears throat> It's always dangerous to walk in on a base as it's loading in just because it's like there's so much stuff that could go wrong. You could glitch into a wall. You could glitch out a truck. Crazy stuff. What in the world? It really is truly gone. No. Do I have a random conveyor out there somewhere? Just hanging out. What about underneath? No, nothing? Hmm. Oh, wait, wait, wait. It didn't move it. This is the conveyor I was moving. There we are, okay. And E, there we go, sweet. Okay, so now that that works, oh, jump backwards. There we go, okay. So that first saw blade's not gonna cut, but the rest of them should. Hopefully. What? They're not cutting through it. Why not? Hmm. Wonder why that didn't work. Hmm. Well, I could always just place them on top. That'd work. Here, let's uh, line this one up. Oh, come here. Uh, okay. We're gonna line you up right here. Maybe. There's one. It's the exact same spot. I'm gonna move this one. I'm gonna go right beside him. Come on, come on, get on there. No, no, over, over here, dude. Uh, ugh, that's not where I said to go. Over here, dude. Just on the thing. There it goes. Boom, like that. Ha ha. Now, this is going to be a little bit more tricky. I'm gonna have to make this the same height. Can we move one of these and make it the same height? Yeah, that'll work. Whoa! No, it's a little high. Hmm. We're gonna have to come down one. Hold on, let's move this. Can, can we place it on top of the feet? There we go. Will that be about the right level? I hope so. If not, we're in trouble. We're in trouble. <clears throat> Uh-oh. We're in trouble. All right, there's that. Is that staggered? That is not staggered. That is in alignment. No. Okay, so we need to stagger you off by just a little bit. There we go. Is that staggered? That's not going to touch, is it? Ooh! Well, it touched, but that's not... Hmm. Well. Can I get it in there any closer? 
There we go. Maybe. There you go. There you go. Good job, buddy. <clears throat> so this is all going to have to push that direction off to one side. Oh, that was not cool. Hold on. Put this back. Come on. Get right next to your buddy there. Come on. You guys are like partners in crime. Come on, chop saws. Unite. Oh, there we go. Sweet. <clears throat> so each one of these should be a single unit as it cuts. Well, except for this first half or this first portion, which is going to be a half unit. Hmm. <laughs> okay, let's hook up the wires. Just like we did before. And here, actually get, get rid of that one for the moment. I can place this, move. Come here, you. We're going to set you. Uh, rotate. Rotate in that direction. Uh, and turn one. Uh, three. <laughs> there we go. Move. Now I should be able to go here. 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 Finished. Here we are. Grab this one. Move. I'm going to go right here, to here, and over. Finished. That's good. Good, good, good. Move here. Down to here. This has got to go under the conveyor somehow. Hmm. If I end up placing it on the conveyor belt itself, should work, right? Should. There we are. Okay, please go across, go across. Oh, oh, there we go. So it's on the conveyor, that way we can build around it. Otherwise I would have to uh, figure out a different way of going about putting these together. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Hold on. You can put this off to the edge. Here we go. There we go. I do apologize about the sniffles. Like, it's... It's bugging me so bad. <clears throat> and I know you guys can hear it inside the videos and inside the recordings. Just know that I'm okay. And I'm getting better. Thank you for all the well wishes and concerns and getting well soons. Rest, video games, plenty of fluids. And that's the doctor's cure. The video games part, that is that is vital. You must play video games to get well. You must play Roblox to feel better. Okay. So, I'm going to do this. Hopefully it works. We'll just let that chew through for a little bit. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. <laughs> There's something still cutting in there, so I'm just I'm just gonna let it go. <laughs> Alright, let's turn it off. Let's see what kind of units it came out with. Oh gosh, I'm so worried. Oh my gosh. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Oh, nice. One, two, three, four. Are those perfect units? Oh, those are perfect units, guys. Oh my gosh. Perfect one unit chop saw. <laughs> All right. So let's grab. Oh, that one's broken apart. So, wait, did the first one, I guess the first one chopped at one unit, didn't it? Oh, that is so cool. All right, let's pull these off like this. They're a little bouncy. 
They're a little bouncy. That's okay. <laughs> I feel so dangerous sitting inside the sawmill or inside the chop saws. Okay, let's do that again. Just comes down and perfectly saws them. Oh, that is so cool. Okay. I don't hear any more sawing, so release. All right, let's go see what it did. Oops. I'll be up here. Okay. Not perfect chop saw, but look at that. <laughs> we got a glitch. That looks like a good one. And then we got a couple of half pieces here. So that's that's no good. There's a perfect one. Oh my gosh. What about this one? Nope, a little half piece. So, uh-oh, I lost that one. Darn. Oh, man. Is that the one that's got the glitch? No, is it that one? There it is. Okay, and I'll leave that one up like this. Uh, by the way, that won't stay there. That'll disappear next episode. Anyhow, one, two, three, four, five, six. I've got six perfect cut pieces. Um... Yeah, let's uh, let's try them out. Let's go to floors, large floors, and one, two, come on, come on, two, three, four, five, and six. So, with that one little piece of wood, I should be able to fill in all of these. Oh, buddy, there's one. And two. And no, 96. Oh, I could have sworn that was perfect. Okay, so now we use a little half piece. Uh, looks like this one might be off too. Nope, that one was a fool. And that one. <laughs> that one was a Cineac, you fool. Ha, <laughs> get it, fool. Oh no, 99, almost perfect. Like how do you get a 99 with a single unit? That is that is insane. Oh my gosh, okay. And let's grab this one since it's non-glitched. There we go. So that's, that's really good. <clears throat> I'll have to incorporate this somehow. I don't know, like, since the planks come out really long, you would have to push this over the course of like 12 straight conveyors off to one side slowly, very slowly, just to get it to line up on a perfect edge like that. But then you could use that edge in the wall, um, say, have a laser across this first portion right here that will trip and have a um, door or not a door, a um, hatch. The hatch is on an incline, that way the wood doesn't stop, technically. And then it might be better to have a delay in between each one of the chop saws, so they start chopping at different times and coming down like this. And then at the end of the, the thing, have it open up the hatch at the front, that way all the wood comes out. So it, yeah, we're, that's a lot of work. That's more work than I've gotten in 30 minutes. I I could try. I could try throwing it in there. But uh, for now, I think I'm just going to build. Uh, hold on. How are these aligned? That's the wrong alignment, isn't it? All right, move. Let's do a turn and a rotate. Is that how they're lined up? Yeah, that's good. Okay. So we're just gonna we're gonna build. I'm gonna build me a bridge. Wait, I've already built a bridge. <laughs> <clears throat> I'm very happy with the way the one unit chop saws are turning out. Like these are pretty cool. Measuring out in units, mathematics. Mathematics are easy and simple to to do. Um, basically just need the formula. Same thing with uh, Rubik's Cubes. Rubik's Cubes, once you know the uh, logarithms, it becomes 
muscle memory, basically. Unlike figuring them out. I forgot I still had wires down here. Oh my goodness. Let's go put those over there. Finished. Hold on. Don't want to get too far away from these before moving them up. Finished. Looks like I still had a couple of uh, tiles. Large tiles over there. Oh, there we go. Move that. Move it out the way. And good. Finish that. <clears throat> Man. Man. <clears throat> We've just been building like crazy, haven't we? Uh. Oh, uh, to the person, I th think... I don't remember who commented, but somebody told me about the um, the wedges. To leave them as the one-fourth as it would be the easiest one to drive up of. So, I will do that. I will leave the one-fourth wedge. And it makes sense. Like, yes, the, uh, the volcano does have a steep incline, but also think about how hard it is getting up it in one shot. And if you get hit or if you get sideways, how much work it is to get turned back around and get straightened out. So we'll leave it at one-fourth. Just because of the angle it's going up and stuff like that. My goodness. So, so much build. Such wow. Sorry, that's doge talk. Move. And yes, to the person that commented, uh, the goldwood is so easy on the eyes. Yes, it is. It's very soft color. Like, it's, it's bright and it's pretty. But it is easier to look at. So, if you don't agree, you can always comment down below. Let me know. Oops. Okay, fine. I'll build on my land. Mm. Alright. Well, let's try that again. Shall we? Alright, I want to chop, chop, chop. And I'm just guesstimating here. I don't know the exact measurements or whatnot. Oops, not that one, this one. And there, whoa, 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 whoa. Jump up here, jump over here, jump right here. Where'd it go? Oh, there it is. Okay, it was hiding. There you are. Stay right there. Don't move. No, I don't want to move it. I want to toggle. Toggle, please. Toggly toggle. It's chopping. It's chopping. And done. Toggle. We'll go up and see how I did. And one, two, three, four. Nicely done. Oh, that is so cool. <clears throat> three large floors. One, two, three, four. It finished. Finished? Oh, wait. One. There we go. B finished. One. Oh, 99. What? One. Two. Three. No, it took one. Darn it. <clears throat> that one that is 99, I am pretty sure, I'm confident, that that is the first brick, or the first block that's getting cut. So, let's turn this one. <clears throat> so it's... Uh, so it's like this. Alright, and I'm going to... Ooh, wait, stop, 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 stop. I'm going to cut it again. I'm going to let it cut. <clears throat> In the first portion, like the portion that's closest to the wall we're going to grab, I bet that's the 99. We have, we have a chance to check it out here. Okay. Nope, nope, nope. Come on. There you go. 
Okay. Jump up here. Portion this portion right here. This should be the 99. Nope, that was a perfect unit. <laughs> oh well. Theories. That's a game theory. Well, kinda. It's a lumber theory. Lumber theory. <gasps> the new series coming to a YouTube channel near you. Alright, since we have it, we'll go ahead and use it. There you go, buddy. <clears throat> now we can just move those into place. Move. This is going to be like an entire floor. I'm just going to keep building. Oh, look. There's the... the Yeah. Um, hmm. I wonder how I'm going to get down to that. Can I build on top of that? Or build under it? Maybe I can build under it. Oh, that, that would work. There we go. Cool. Bigger target. Now, you. Come with me. You go up there. I'm not going to be able to get back up there, am I? No. That's okay. We'll just do this. Move. <laughs> I want to be a building master. Lumberjack. Drive my cars faster. Alright. There we are. We'll just set this all down. And drop this one in. Good. Should we take a, a quick peek for uh, Spookwood to see if anything is resed in? Or grown? Yeah, let's do it. Why not? Uh, how much time do we have? What time, what time am I at? Hold on. <clears throat> We're at 27 minutes? Wow! Dude, I th I literally I thought this was only like 15 minutes long. Wow. Okay. Well, um, let's do this. If we're going to go run around, I've got to grab a fast car. Wait, is this utility too? Ooh, utility truck two is in front of all the presents. No. Okay. Let's clear these off. Come on, guys. Come on. Somebody asked me to make a, a garage door in my comments. So, um, I will think about it. Um, I know I've been asked to make garages before. And there's a lot of people with tutorials on how to make a car garage out there. So, I don't know if it would be beneficial for you guys or if you'd want to see that. Comment down below if, you, if there's something you'd like to see me build or if there's like questions about logic. Um, I, can, I can answer most questions. Um, if I just see you say, hi code or hello, then... I usually don't respond to them as quickly. Well, well, that's... I read all my comments as much as I can. There's a couple of comments that might sneak through every once in a while, but for the most part, I do read the comments. I just don't respond to all of them. And that's something I've had to come to terms with. Like, there's a lot of people that comment. And if I were to take a minute... Well, yeah, a minute... Per comment just to do a response I mean that's still a lot of comments that I've got to respond to I did uh, I did an episode a time-lapse episode of like an entire hour of me just responding to to comments and I shortened it to like I time-lapsed it over three minutes or something like that it you you would see you see how much time it takes for me to Look at the question, read the question, respond to the question. Like, sometimes it's just really quick, but other times it's just like, oh my gosh. All right, here we go. Turn on your lights code. Safety first. Got your belt on? I do. Yay. <clears throat> All right, let's go looking for some spook wood. Of course, we're traveling at night again. It's the best time to search for spook wood, right? Of course. When everything's dark. <clears throat> By the way, huge shout out to all the Trolliversers. That video is going to be coming out tomorrow. Uh, we recorded our halftime series. 
which was amazing. I won't give you guys any any spoilers or anything. Just know that it is coming out. It'll be out tomorrow. No spookwood. No. There's a birch with no no limbs. No no leaves. Boom boom boom. Oh, that's a cool looking tree. Look at that one. I like how its leaves are just all in one little bundle. That's cool. Nothing over there. Nothing over there. Anything up there? Did you see? I gotta go this direction. Nope, nothing, nothing, nothing. Alright. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna find anything. I will continue to look, though. Um... Actually, I might not look tonight. I'm I'm gonna go take some medication because I mean this is 30 minutes and I'm already starting to go <coughs> snot up again. So I need to go blow my nose, and I don't want to blow my nose on camera because that'd be disgusting. And then you guys would be like, "Ew, Coach just blew his nose on the camera. It's disgusting." I'd be like, "Yeah, I know. I'm sorry." Yeah. Okay, th this is, yeah, I'm, it's, we're not progressing at all at this. Okay. Uh, 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 uh. Thank you, everyone, for watching this episode of Lumber Tycoon 2 with me, Heath Haskins, Code Primate. As we build up the one-unit chop saw, having new theories and new ideas on how to get the perfect one-unit chop. Um, yeah, I hope you've enjoyed it. If not, there's not really too much I can do about it now. You just watched it. I mean, you could comment and like and subscribe if you wanted to, but that is completely your choice. And that's what's called a call out at the end of videos. That's where, you know, call to action, where you, you're supposed to go do something. You don't have to. That is completely up to you. I love you guys very much. Have a great night. And we will talk to you very sickly soon. Goodbye. <laughs> Outro. I completely forgot to say I love you guys. I love you guys. Have a good night.